Have you ever considered getting a thermal imaging camera like this? Well, these are an excellent tool for heating engineers, plumbers, electricians, and general DIYers. And you can use them for a whole host of things, including checking heat loss and thermal bridging within your home. And not only that, this particular model is packed with features. So let's see what you get in the box. So you get a nice little carry case that will protect the camera itself. Some instructions, and every male knows you don't need them. The actual camera itself, and this is USC plug for your phone, specifically for Android phones. You get an extra lead so you can plug it into a laptop or into your phone and use it remotely. And a cloth for cleaning the lens. This particular thermal imaging camera is a Top Don TC001 and it really is so easy to get started. All you need to do is head over to your Google Play Store and download the app TC001. Once you've done that, you're ready to go. However, if you're struggling, you can hit refer back to this user manual, scan that QR code, and that will give you a really detailed, friendly user manual to go through any settings on your phone. So once you've installed the uh, TC001 app, you can click on it and open it. And then that gives you a few different options. You can get your thermal imaging camera. You can plug it in in like a selfie mode to face you, or you can turn it around to face away from you. That slots straight in. You can then click on thermal imaging. And now you can see that is ready to go. So there's been a few times that I've used this Top Don TC001 thermal imaging camera around the house. And the first time I've used it actually was checked for leakage around this particular front door. We had a real bad problem with, with the draft. And I've actually solved that on one of my previous videos and put before and after photos on. I also use the thermal imaging camera to show the before and after effects of adding secondary glazing to drafty windows. So a while ago, we installed these Radflex radiator panels to every radiator that's on an external wall in the house. And the difference is actually remarkable. You can really feel a difference. And we have installed these in previous houses. So all these do is drop behind the radiators themselves. And as you can see on the screen, they do make a difference with the thermal properties of the radiator. So as you can see on the screen, you can actually look at your house and see where you're losing heat and where is insulated. And actually on the screen, you can see Right at the very top on the chimney, you can see that's actually kicking out some heat. And that is because we've got the log burner going today because it is quite cold. So that's another good use that you can use this camera for. This is a time-lapse video of a radiator filling up with hot water on the central heating. And you can check for any blockages or restrictions of flow. So... If you're one of the 65% of people watching this channel and you've not subscribed, what are you waiting for? Click down below, click subscribe. Don't forget, hit the notification bell and that way you won't miss out on any of my future videos. You can also use your thermal imaging camera to look at the insulation within your house. In this instance, you can see the four squares above my head and that is insulation that I've put in this part of the ceiling. However, you can also check for thermal bridging around your property to check for heat loss. Let's talk about the app then and some of the features that are available to you as the user. So the first thing, which is the most obvious, is you can take photos and videos. However, on the screen, it will always display the hottest point and the coldest point and display the temperatures accordingly. Once you've took your images and your videos you can head over to the gallery and you'll find everything safely stored in there 
So when you're taking a thermal image or a video, you've got a few options. You can select this here, and that allows you to use something called a dual light function. Now, what that actually does is uses the camera on your phone as well as the thermal imaging camera. And that way you can then see the actual image and the thermal image as well. And that allows you to see both images at the same time. Another function is this button here, and that allows you to change the color variations of the heat scale on the camera. Now that can be useful depending on the environment you're in to clearly differentiate between the hot and cold zones of your photo itself. So another really good function of this app and the camera is temperature monitoring. And that allows you to set your camera up and film over a period of time an exact point within that photo or video. And that allows you to monitor things rising or falling in temperature. And to do that, all you need to do is click temperature monitoring, real time, generate the image, press OK. You can t take a dot, a line, we'll have a dot. And then if you just select it, start the recording. And now this produces a graph and you can see from the point we're filming, any movement of that temperature, whether it rises or falls, represents in this graph. And when we're finished filming, we can then replay this graph and the image and notice any difference in temperature. So if you're interested in getting one of these Top Don TC001 thermal imaging cameras, head over to my Amazon store and I've got them in there. And not only that, at the minute there is a discount on and you can get them cheaper than the normal price. So I hope you like this review. Don't forget, I've got more videos and more reviews on my channel.